Hello everyone, my name is Sumungri and I'd like to welcome you guys all back to more Sly Cooper and the Thievius Raccoonus. And here we have the Marie! Just playing along like always. And I think I figured out a way to get we are heading to Haiti, as Bentley said, to dabble in some voodoo with Ms. Rupi. Let's get it started. The third member of the Fiendish Five was the infamous voodoo priestess, Ms. Ruby. Born into a family of mystics, other children found her scary. Teaching herself to summon the undead provided what few friends she had. A career in crime allowed an adult Ms. Ruby to punish the world for fearing her as a child. Chief mystic for the Fiendish Five, her powers allowed them to break both the laws of man and nature at the same time. Yet despite the whirlwind success of her youth, she managed to slip into obscurity. Last known sightings claim she headed out of civilization and deep into the Haitian jungle. Sly Cooper in... Vicious Voodoo. Ooh, that looks like it would hurt. No pins in my body. No thank you. The Dread Swamp Path. Uh-oh. Bayou Lily. Down to the bayou. We got frogs, we got crickets, we got stuff to eat. Voodoo and all that mystical stuff. And this mosquito flying along that looks half dead. Yeah. Look at him. He's just like bent out of shape. Literally bent out of shape. His beak. Or his stinger thing. Wait. Did he just suck my blood? Did he just suck my blood dry? Did you just suck my blood dry? Oh. That would be the worst. Just getting your blood sucked dry by this mosquito here. Come on. Come on, mosquito. Can't we just be friends? It's like not even an attack from him. He's just like, <laughs> I don't have enough energy. Sorry, Sly, but this is one mission you will have to accomplish without me. You don't believe in ghosts, do you? Sure I do. My scanners have picked up verifiable paranormal activity. But that's not the problem. This swamp is oozing with disgusting mold and bacteria. Suck it up, Bentley. We got work to do. All right, then. Don't forget to use the new move you learned from Mugshot section of the Thievius Raccoonus. You mean the Raccoon Railwalk? The roots and vines around here are perfect for that. All you gotta do is... Jump and hit the circle button. Especially where you see the bark has been worn away, and where it's super slick from Mickey Slime and Moss, you'll rail slide like a skater grinding pipe. I'm liking it. I'm liking it. What is Bentley talking about? All he has to do is sit in the van and communicate through the binocular. Come on, Bentley. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? We've been doing this without you. Well, not without you. You've been in our head, but we've been doing this physically. Without you, the last three zones, this included, of course. Who's putting these bottles here? Why is that mosquito before? So dead! Oh my goodness, spiders just scared the living daylights out of me. I do not like spiders. Well, I don't mind them because they're supposed to kill the mosquitoes. So they're really not doing a good job because... Well, unless that was the last mosquito we have seen. And another spider. No! No! Woo! There he is again. We're on our last life. We need blood. You know what? Raccoon blood? Not for you, Mr. Mosquito. No, 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 no. Come on. They're all like warty or like have like weird spots. <laughs> Such a weird bad guy. But humorous nonetheless. Probably my favorite bad guy thus far. Mr. Dying Mosquito. Anything over here? Oh, bottles we missed. Bottles we miss. Bottles we miss. Jumping into the swamp. You know, I felt like getting a little bit more dirty. Oh, we were still alive? Nice. Okay. How do we get up here? How do we get up there? That is a good question. Hmm. Can we go back up here? There's gotta be a way. I gotta be able to jump on this rail. Jump over there from that. We're backtracking now. Back into the thick. No, no secret? Okay. Hmm. That one confuses me a little bit. 
Oh, phew. Almost jumped in the swamp again. Can we not make this jump? Can we not make this? Can't make that jump. Oh my goodness. Dying. I'm not gonna give up that easy, though. Not gonna give up that easy. Please give me the bottle. Yes. But I think that's death. Oh no, we don't take damage from water anymore because we got that. Oh yeah, we're awesome. So how do we get in there? All right, we're gonna figure it out. It's gotta be over here. It's gotta be this way somewhere. Right here? Hmm. All right, there's bottles everywhere. Every direction. All right, all right what? Okay. Okay, Sly. I don't really understand your obsession with going into the swamp water. It could be creepy crawly things in there. Go school! Spiders! Probably not in the water. But spiders here, nonetheless. Now, there's gotta be a way up from here. And this place is kind of a cool zone. Not gonna lie. This is like, whoa. Root thing! I was expecting to see swamp thing, but now we got root thing. Did root thing kill me? Game over! Game over, man! Rude thing, you win. You're awesome. Alright, we'll meet you guys back at that spot. Oh my gosh, it's spitting out my blood. That sick, sick mosquito! Time to take out Rude Thing once and for all. Come on, Rude Thing. Come on. You're getting punished. Yeah! Sit down, Rude Thing. Sit down. Go back where you came from. Into the ground. Ooh, now we're going up top. I knew it. Straight to the top with Cooper. <gasps> More root things. Not cool. Please get the bottles. Yes. Root thing. No. Oh, really? He's dying there. He's oozing. He's oozing. Come on, I'm just laying down this free guy on me. Oh. No, why we gotta start right here? Why? Alright, meet you guys back in a second. Alright guys, we're coming up to root thing, and I think I finally figured out what I gotta do. Stand in place and learn from the mole and just whack away. Whack away. Whack away. Whack away. Aw, yeah. Get your whack on. NBD. No big deal. For all you guys that don't know acronyms out there. So here we are up tap. There's a bottle right here. We gotta get every bottle. These first levels are always a bit more difficult with bottles. I think we came from that way. So we gotta try and get everyone as we go. Can I make that jump? It's a risky jump there. Hold on. I don't like that when we use the Binocucom now, we don't get to see the bottles. We have to pick that up in every zone. I'm not a fan of that. I wanna just have that for good. What's that guy doing up there? I wonder if he knows the guru. He's wearing kind of the same sort of stuff. Do you know the guru? Do you know the guru? We need Demurry out here. Maybe he can persuade this guy to let us go by peacefully. But we are in Haiti, so unlikely. Because Haiti, such an awesome place to be. Everybody wants to go there. When you're like thinking about vacation, you're like, oh yeah, Haiti, Haiti. Mm -hmm. Yep, yeah, mm -hmm. I want to just get bit by giant mosquitoes. Perfect, let's go to Haiti. Oh, that guy doesn't know the guru. I didn't ask. But asking gets you killed. That's Miss Ruby's lair. To get in, you'll need that key on top of a tiki pedestal in the guard compound. There's a bad mojo force field protecting it, so you'll have to destroy all five of the purple candles surrounding it. No problem. Don't get cocky or you'll end up with your head shrunk to the size of a pea. You've got to get past those voodoo guards, and I'm warning you, they're made and they work like a team. So do we, buddy. I never really understood voodoo people's obsession with shrinking heads. And then you, you get your head all shrunk and you're like, mm, I can't see anything now, my eyes are so tiny and I talk like this. What am I going to do with my life? I can't even eat good food anymore. Back to baby food. Or some sort of, ooh, bottle. Alright, enough of that. We're gonna get these bottles for sure. So we don't have to get them again. And the safe we did spot a second ago. These guys are working together pretty well. There goes one. Where was that safe? I'm gonna make sure and get it. Maybe it'll give us something good. Press the circle to enter the vault 
code. If I did my math right, and I always do my math right, then the combination has got to be 588. Eight. You're math. You love math. Oh, Bentley, you dog, you. You and your numbers and stuff. Electrified! Kelly McCooper's notes on how to harness the electromagnetic field created by a rolling raccoon. Now your raccoon roll move will really pack a punch. Plus, it should give you a nice tingling sensation. Booyah, baby! I like to tingle, and I like to roll. Everyone knows that. And now I'm on an electrifying roll. Boom! No! Don't kill me. Don't kill me. Roll. Roll. Put your roll on. Aw, uh, yeah. Okay, candles. That's two down. So I'm liking this roll now. That's gonna be a lot more useful. And if these guys weren't such a big pain in the butt, it would be a lot easier. I don't know why they need their flashlight. Can they just use their voodoo magic? Apparently not. You've done it! The Mojo Force Field is down, and you can steal the key! Of course I've done it, Bentley. There's the door. I have a nice looking door. Wonder if I can get that at my house. Always wanted the bat wings on the side with the evil sinister eyes staring at you. Always wanted that. Either way, booyah, Sly! Job complete! So now we're just here. We have to physically go open the door, it doesn't open for us. Come on, where's the voodoo magic? Into the creepy portal! That's exactly what I wanted to do. The Swamp's Dark Center. Alright, next time guys, we will meet you, well after this. My paranormal scanner is maxing out on that structure! A reading like that could only be coming off Ms. Ruby herself. I think you're right, Sly. If you want to crack at Ms. Ruby, you're going to have to find a way inside that Skull Temple. Do we really want to crack at Miss Ruby? She is an alligator. I don't know. That's one place I do not want to visit, and I do not want to be the dentist either. That's way too many teeth to clean. Way too much gingivitis. Way too many cavities. Not to mention, it's pretty much the jaws of death. Wake up, you lazy bags of swamp gas! The voodoo vibe is sick tonight! Let's take advantage of this powerful mojo and step up production! Keep piling those shiny bones into the sink! We'll have an army of ghosts by morning and take over! Okay, a little crazy. First of all, no one's listening to you because that guy's still just walking back and forth with his flashlight. Ha <laughs> ha! And second of all, why do you want to take over Mexico? I mean, come on. There's a lot better countries to take over. No offense if you're from Mexico, but you can't even drink the water there. So either way, I hope you guys all enjoyed the episode. Thumbs up for Sly. Thumbs up for Voodoo. Thumbs up for clean water. And also, subscribe for more. Have a great day, everyone.